Last week, as president of COP26, Alex Sharma set out to Parliament his four key aims for the UN summit. As UK parliamentarians, we wanted to set out our four key priorities ahead of the negotiations at the UN summit later this year. This process has to be democratic. The climate crisis affects everyone, so everyone has to have a say over how we deal with it. For too long now, this issue has been the preserve of political elites and billionaires. This is a class issue and working people need to be at the forefront of how we deal with it because we are at the forefront of its effects. Our approach must also be brave and transformational. For every moment we wait, for every 0.1 degree rise, we risk millions of people suffering. We have to face up to the crisis. And in order to do that, we need to have a rapid global decarbonisation plan. And the outcomes must centre justice. Climate justice is indivisible from social and economic justice. Any plans to tackle the climate crisis must ensure that working class people, people of colour and those in the global south who are least responsible for causing the crisis are not forced to bear the costs. It must contain accountability. Our government's track record on climate change is littered with half-hearted targets and broken promises. Any plans must be rigidly followed and contain a robust accountability mechanism. If governments or the big polluters fail to take the action required, they must face strict consequences.